All right. Yeah, we are live. Hey guys, we are live at the Reclaim Lodges ROCC Fall Extravaganza. I just wanted to give you guys a little tour of our booth. It's not quite complete in true Jamie Ray fashion. We still have to go home and get some work done. But it's coming. We're going to get some pillows. This is the bench you guys saw us working on live the other day. It's painted in sweet pink and smoke paint and creamy. And then we did a um, dark stain on it, which turned out amazing. And then we've got our lumber chair. Oh, catch comments. Yeah. Oops, sorry. I'm slacking. Hey, Unstoppable Gaming. I can see comments. All right, we're good. I can see the comments. This is the farm table that we worked on. Debbie, want to bring them in here? Yep. Sorry, we're going we're gonna to be seeing mostly Jamie because I'm going to chase her around as steady as I can and film so for you guys. We set up our booth space. We try to make it like a little store and we put like things together and we leave a walkway so people can get through. And then, yeah, so we've got our paint here, our core molds, candlesticks, t shirts, the world's largest cotton wreath. Oh, hang on, let me come around this way so they can see it and get a sense of how big. This is from that cotton that my mom brought us from Texas. Yeah, so it's a three foot cotton wreath. Are you guys catching all these goodies in the background? They're talking about the double tier centerpiece. These ones, CJZ. They love them. So we are gonna do a DIY on these. I um, saw them kind of done at Pinner's conference a little bit differently, but we're gonna do a DIY and we're also going to be selling the kits, like all the pieces and the tins, if I can get enough of them. I'll sell the kits or at least we'll sell the pieces. Gonna make that something we have on the website. Yeah. Here, let's show the so thing that, this is uh, this is what took the longest today. This uh, this canopy with our old um, porch supports here. Judy says she'll take one of each. Yeah. And a DIY on the cotton wreath. I think you already have something similar on the cotton wreath, don't yeah, you? Or did you just? It's just hot glue. We just took the cotton and hot glued it on a grapevine wreath. There's really no DIY. That's it. That's the whole start to finish. That's the whole DIY. Cotton glue, cotton. <laughs> Oh, yep. Yeah. Here's a little one. These are just like the little, show them the back of it. These are like so, the little teeny tiny. So these are just like the little uh, reed wreaths or whatever. Or... So when I when I cut the cotton off, I made sure that I had the stems or the, like the star part of it. And I put those in randomly. So that's why you get, it's not all just. Gives it some texture. Yep. Yeah. And you can just get those down at like Hobby Lobby, Michael's, yeah. craft stores. Deb made this tote for Studio 5 the other day. So we've got that. Let's um, see. Really if you guys like to go to thrift stores. I picked up this lamp for fifteen dollars, and I painted. Hi, Heather. It, I painted it with a DIY paint, and then the lampshade. I just took all the fabric off, and we put an Edison bowl. It's a skeleton shade now. Skeleton shade. All right. Well, this is our booth here. Do you guys want to go on a walkabout? We'll show you the whole market. Oh, do you have time to show them the whole market? I have. got her milk paint order. Yeah. I'm so excited. Hey, Andrea. Those little blue pieces are my favorite. They're just salvage off of an old table. Out of our backyard. That was in our backyard. All right, so we're gonna kind of do a little pan. Hopefully I'm not too shaky if you get motion sick. I'll try to stop at every booth and show you, but we've got a lot of booths. I set up yet. This is Brooks from Start at Home. She has a YouTube channel. You should subscribe, um, but she's not set up, so she probably won't want you to see. Hey, Nerala and oh Jacob, gosh, hope I'm saying your name right. Amazing. This old church pew. I, this this is no longer our booth. This is whose booth no, is this? All fixed up. This is my friend Angela's booth. It's super cute. And um, yeah, I would so take this home with me. The 4 a.m. in the UK. Four Man. Dedicated. Thanks for watching. Get 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 back to sleep <laughs> after you watch us live. So this is kind of a pan. I don't know if you can see it, but we're on one side of so the market. We wish you could be here too, Mary. It's gonna be fun. It starts tomorrow at 9 a.m. It's gonna be awesome. I probably could make a pew similar to that. It'd take a minute, but you're right, Amy. I could probably do it. Here, I'll let you guys see me. I'm looking pretty tired and sleepy. Zeb was <laughs> at home and I was here people dealing, which most of my vendors are really sweet, so it's not a big deal. Every now and then you get somebody who's sleep deprived you just have to remember that everybody's running on like two hours of sleep, so it gets a little bit crazy, and you just have to be patient and kind with people. Thanks, Mary. <laughs> oh, we walked by all this stuff, all this cool There's stuff, and we didn't see. Hang on, we'll show them William's booth. There's some. Uh, 
raggedy Angie. She sells clothing and all kinds of cool stuff. I'll give you a little pan here. How many vendors do we have this year, Jamie? 50 vendors. Well, we 50? Have over 50 spaces, but some are double booth, so it's kind of hard. And this is William Bells. He always does cool stuff. This is just old broken table legs and things, and he takes them and he paints them. Oh, she got her. The fairy chalk mother right here. The fairy the chalk mother. She makes it with her own two hands and her all these children. <laughs> oh, I missed a comment, Mariah. The Arizona one. I can't see him in the... When are you guys coming back to Phoenix? Um, we always are trying to come back to Arizona. That's where all of our family's at. So who knows? We'll probably in the spring sometime. I, I can't make any promises. Um, Lily says, hey, busy day for you guys tomorrow. I bet you're all excited. These are some fun Christmassy signs. Yeah. Some more cotton, another vendor that does corbels. Got some cool designs there. We've got a lot of really talented vendors. All right, Jamie left, so the commentary is all quiet now. <laughs> She's the life of the party, I know, I know. So there is a lot of holiday stuff here. There's Thanksgiving stuff and Christmas stuff. You can see in the booth behind Zeb right now, this is a lot of Christmas. Yeah, the joy. And find a lot of that stuff if you're wanting to. Here, let's take them up on the top tier here. Yep. We're going upstairs, Jamie. Okay. All right, I'm walking again, so don't uh, don't get motion sick. Uh, what are the metal? Oh, um, Heather is asking where we are. We're in Lehigh, Utah, at Thanksgiving Barn. Yeah, Show we're barn. yeah. It's Thanksgiving Point Show Barn in Lehigh, Utah. It starts from nine to five tomorrow. It's the uh, ROCC Fall Extravaganza that Jamie and I put on. And this is uh, this is the market. We got 51 vendors, I think she was saying. So, and it's scary. yeah, that's cool. So lots of signs. Like I said, there's a bunch of Christmas stuff. Yeah. Christmas signs. There's just a lot of antique stuff. Can you guys hear Mariah? Okay. Oh, we lost Jamie. She had to answer some questions to a vendor. <laughs> Well, look at all these fun things they got. These what are like the real vintage. Color of right now. Hottest color of we got Jamie back. All right. I don't know about like, like look at all this architectural salvage, guys. All these knobs. I am totally buying some of these knobs tomorrow. You can't take those home on the plane with somebody, you. Somebody asked um, you what color is in. Weapon? Green is in. Green is in. So like sage green, pantry door. Mint green, like all the greens are in. Well, this if you saw my booth, it's all green. This lady does 10% off to booth. Awesome. Hey, um, are we missing any comments, Mariah? I I can see them for a second on okay. here, and then so they go away. This is amazing. This gal, Simply Rustic Charm, this is her first show. Yeah. Look at her booth. So, Look how good Maria is it. asking, I understand you've done this before. Does a lot of things get sold here? Absolutely. Yep. Not every, not every market's the same, but... Reclaimologist, I own the market, and I put it on, and Reclaimologist is known for furniture. Here, so come stand sell, under the light over here. We sell a ton of furniture here, and if people come, like, we have a really loyal following, and so they come specifically to buy the things that we're selling. People, people come with their trucks and their vans. We get people from Idaho buying tables. Yeah, people come from out of state. And this is a really fun booth because she will custom print your stuff here. So you buy it, you can custom print all your stuff. And she's making my girls, um, well, she's already made my girls. You didn't turn her rolling pin. Oh, I guess I got to turn her rolling pin tonight yeah. when we go home. Um, she custom made my girls unicorn ornaments, and they're super cute, and they have their names on them. Oh, I didn't even see this stuff behind me here. Yeah. You guys getting all this eye candy? Did you see all these? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they've got all the architectural salvage down here. Look at all these old ceiling tins. It looks like they cut them out. A piece of all of this. It looks like they cut them to fit the crown on the original building yeah. that they were in. Nice. We actually have some of this in our garage, but I'm not selling it. <laughs> it's my truck. All right. Let's go walk over here real quick, and then we'll show them the other side, and then we'll sign out and go home and sleep. <laughs> you guys have any more questions while we're walking around here? I'm going to shut these back doors. Okay. Do you want to go on this first one? Yeah. 
Oh, look at those old trucks. Look at that, we got some mantiques up in here. <laughs> oh, that's cool, look at these old shovels. Yeah, that would be awesome if you could come, Lily. That's a long trip, though. <laughs> I'm loving these old crates and these pulleys. This is a booth just for me right here. Look, I can just come hang well, out here tomorrow. These little things they made out of like engine parts. Here's like a spark plug for a head. <laughs> Some springs. It's pretty cute. Oh, look what they did to those old saws. They must be cutting these out with a plasma cutter or something. Can't think of a question too busy drooling. I understand that. Old white stove back where? I missed an old white stove. Oh, right here. Yeah, let's go get you a close up. And it has an oven. The Look oven at that. I'm not gonna go through their display here, but oh, we were looking at the little guys. We didn't even. I didn't even see the stove. <laughs> That's cool. All right, let's run up over here. We still have quite a few more vendors to look at. I'll try to go slow enough so you guys can see some of the fun stuff. Cute, like little trinkets, all kinds of stuff. Signs, lots of signs. If you need signs, yeah. this is a good sign show. And they're all different. Like every vendor seems to have like a different take on them. I like the restores my soul one. I like the shape of that. Yeah, the one up top there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot to see. <laughs> yeah. We still have another tier up here. A couple booths aren't quite set up. Yeah, go on, hop states. You know, you could catch the late night flight and get here in the morning. We're here till five. <laughs> this is kind of a better. We're up on the third tier. You can kind of see. I have it right here. Oh, here's Jamie coming back again. Oh, look at those cool little cloth Christmas trees. I miss those. They're a rag. A rag. Mm -hmm. See, I don't know what stuff's called. I'm just like, yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Our kids are at home sleeping. We got uh, the 15-year-old boy and my 12-year-old daughter's watching Jack. She's in charge of Jack. But they're probably all asleep by now. 15 year olds probably still awake they were all at school most of the day and jack hung out with uh his preschool teacher for a good part of the day too any vendors selling old insulators i haven't seen any insulators here yet that doesn't mean there won't be any over on the other side usually there's a few but they tend to go pretty quick oh look at these cool quilts Any quilters out there? Crocheting. All of those, all of these oh, are Oh, these rugs. Well, and these little baby. Look at these booties. I'll pick it up here. Touching the merchandise. Jeez, look at these booties. They are so you can, cute. You know, Mariah doesn't even have any girls. She's got three boys. And she's like, look at the pink little booties. <laughs> got some I think these are all old vintage books and they take them and they the bindings on the back are broken a lot of times and they bind these up with these ring binders and they're cool they're pretty expensive inexpensive too we always get a couple books for Jack and Redrick when we're here all right Jamie all right. let's go to the other side okay we gotta quit because I gotta go home yep we'll be quick I don't think we showed them Vicky's booth yeah, cool hats. Hey, don't put that on. You gonna buy it? You do look cute in that hat. It is super cute. How much is it? $15. Probably have to get one tomorrow. All of Vicky's stuff. She's got our Christmas. Vicky has stuff for every season, oh and she gosh. brings out all the little stuff. Like, look at all of these old vintage reindeer and little angels, or I don't even know. What did are they called? Booth? Yeah, I did. Okay, let's go around the other side. Alright, we're going to go around the other side. I keep getting distracted. There's a lot to look at. Where did all these leaves come from? I don't know. Yeah. From the door. Here's our booth again. If you guys missed it at the start. If you're just joining, this is mine and Jamie's booth. And our table and that I built. That we were doing the vinegar. We went live the other day. Oh yeah. These we are... made a whole tree of napkin ornaments. 
Oh, Mariah, we need to have a sign that we put like right here. <clears throat> so this is Aaron's booth. He hand paints he all these, right? Every single one of these signs. Yeah, Aaron hand paints all of these, and these are these are cool. Look how cool this one is. I'll turn you sideways so you can see. Oh, it doesn't like that. I have to keep it like this. Lots and lots of furniture. You could furnish Upholstery. several homes. Lots of upholstered um, coffee tables. So these are all coffee tables and then she upholsters them. That's really fun. Yep. But, yeah, this is really cool. Yeah. So this is where all the furniture is. Yeah. Like the furniture that you see here. Yeah. 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 Yeah.